Today, we are going to be writing the formula for the ionic compound sodium hydrogen sulfate. So let's work from left to right and see what we get, right? The first thing I see is I see sodium. So I scan the periodic table to see if I can find a sodium. And yeah, I found it. It's right over here, right? Sodium's in group one and it's represented by an Na. Remember, all elements in group one are metals except for hydrogen, but they all have the same charge. They share a common charge of a plus one. They lose one electron. So I'm going to put sodium, so Na, and then a plus one. Now here's the thing, guys. Remember, ionic compounds, they always have two components to them. But in this case, we have three different words. So that means if I use sodium for one component, hydrogen sulfate should all be clumped together as one thing. And I look at the ending, I see that it's an ATE ending, and all ATE endings are polyatomic ions. Remember, polyatomic ions are never going to be on the periodic table. They need to be memorized. So I put the one that's down here. And as you can see, the whole hydrogen sulfate is HSO4 with the minus one charge. Remember that sulfate is SO4 and the hydrogen, there's only one here, so I just put one H in front. So it's HSO4 and that's what I'm going to write. So hydrogen sulfate HSO4 with a negative one charge. Now we have the two components, so all we do is we crisscross the charges to just get the subscripts and just see how many of each we need. So this plus one crisscrosses down, telling me that I need only one of the hydrogen sulfate. This negative one crisscrosses down, telling me that I only need one of the sodium. When you do this crisscross, don't worry about the charges anymore. You're just focusing on these numbers right here. So let's do it. I have Na, I only have one, so I don't worry about that, right? And then I have only one of my hydrogen sulfates. When you only have one of a polyatomic ion, you do not need parentheses, you just write it out. So in this case, it would just be HSO4. Box that answer off, you're done. So sodium hydrogen sulfate is NaHSO4. Thank you so much for viewing the video. I really hope this helped. Let me know in the comments. Uh, subscribe to the channel if you would like to help us out. That would help us out tremendously. Thank you so much for that. Let's keep rocking and rolling. Good luck on all your future tests and quizzes, and I'll see you in later lessons. Bye-bye.